to see energy vibration reading for the Aries Sun Moon Moon and Rising sign and I'm asking you Aries still um, welcome and I want to say thank you for being here and it's such a pity that less Aries listen to my videos I'm asking the ones who listen to my videos please share my videos I have nothing against Aries my cousins are Aries I love them I have connected with so many Aries people I love you guys because you guys are very hard-working the men are not that nice but that's only it but you women are fantastic I really love working with you guys okay this week for you Aries and I gotta do this um, um, this week for you Aries you're going to have to deal with someone who is the Queen of Swords okay but first of all this is the energy vibration reading for the Aries Sun Moon and Rising sign it is the 2nd of November 2017 the week begins from the 6th until the from the 6th until the 12th and it is the second week okay this is the week of a hair sign and the zodiac energy of water so stand strong in this week whatever is happening stand strong in this week okay find the inner strength you have to deal with someone who is the queen of sword whoever this person is the queen of sword you have to deal with them but you are going to have the inner strength to deal with them as we look at your week on Monday you have a water sign on Monday it's going to be a mystical day it's as if strange things are happening on Monday Tuesday is a wonderful powerful day you have the energy of the Emperor it's going to be good because the Emperor is your energy vibration which is wonderful and positive the week is going to be crowned by the Empress so you're going to have the energy of the Empress you're looking for each other you're um, making sure that everyone is um, you know okay and that sort of a thing on um, Thursday you have the six of ones good information is coming to you wonderful positive messages are coming into you and this is going to be good on Friday you have the energy of the lovers which is good a lot of you will be connecting in your love relationships a lot of you will be meeting someone new a lot of you will be connecting with love and you have on um, Saturday the heavenly master which is the air offense thus there is going to be a situation with groups of people on Saturday it could be that is a church connection or um, a wedding or um, a party or some situation it could be hospitals I'm seeing a lot of people going to the hospitals emergency and that sort of a thing not that you're sick but maybe you're going to visit someone in the hospital that that, that, that is there it could be your father that you will be visiting in the hospital because this week is a week of uh, um, um, you're you're nurturing everyone and um, there is a sense of nurturing the number six plays a significant role it's all about your materialistic balance in this week six you have six three times so you have the six of, of, of ones the six of coins and the lovers oh my god this is this this and then you have um, the Emperor and the Empress beside each other so there is definitely something happening for you guys you have the six of ones which is good news you have the six of Pentacles which you're receiving help and giving also help so you're balancing out giving and receiving and you have the energy of the lovers so this is good so okay let's go on and look at certain situation in your life you have the five of cups on Monday Ah, the stars so you are going to be very good with work your financial situation is going to be good you have um, messages coming in you're looking for your inner peace and light you are going to be connecting with some um, one of your someone from your past there is a situation with a six of Pentacles there is a lot of six happening for you guys and you have the energy of uh, the 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 new love in reverse okay so whatever the situation is with this queen of sword it's as if as someone who you work with it could be your mom um, that she's not very happy with you at this moment and it could be yeah it could be your mom that she's not very happy with you at this moment and who uh, yeah I'm getting this for a lot of people that is your mom and she's not very happy with you at this moment it could be someone at your work and this new love is in reverse so be aware of what is going on you 
need to understand because with the ace of cup being in reverse Monday is a water day Monday is a water day Monday is the energy of the angman and you have the angman twice in your reading so the number 12 is here twice and you have three times six and the number 12 so remember three times six and the number um, 12 um, Monday is going to be a very mysterious day for you a very very mysterious day for you Aries whatever is happening on Monday it's going to be very mysterious you're having the energy of the five of cups but this five of cups is that it's a miss is so mysterious it's weird so you're trying to figure out what exactly is going on so you're feeling and you're seeing um, and you're experiencing things on real things balance you need balance you need balance you need to ground yourself and how you can ground yourself is that you ask the angels and guides to ground yourself or you go outside and walk bare feet okay that's how you ground yourself to mother heart so there is something that is happening something very mysterious extremely mysterious that is happening so you have to be careful and look around and um, look and see whatever is going on be on your P's and Q's on Monday on Tuesday you have the energy of the Emperor and some of you are going to have a situation with your father some of you this is about work and whatever you're doing you are doing very well because the energy um, is positive whatever it is your boss your supervisors and people are looking at you they are um, having a good world they're speaking about the work that you're doing and it is very very positive on Wednesday and the crowning of your week you have the energy of the Empress this is good this is a very supported energy you are going to be using this energy and being nurtured to either everyone and you're going to be supporting everyone and nurturing everyone but yet still you need to first nurture yourself okay so remember to balance your emotional self your money or materialistic needs you have no need to worry because the Empress is going to come in this week to help you with that as we move on on Thursday's good news you have been in limbo waiting for information on, on Thursday the information will be coming in that you have been waiting for so if you had asked for help or if you um, were waiting for a response uh, um, to, for work or that sort of a thing it's going to happen for you on Thursday you are going to receive this message it is going to be good on Thursday this message is going to come in on Friday it's wonderful because you have the energy of the lover another number six energy and you are working together with your partner your husband and wife to make your relationship much better but working together for the best for both of you and you this is going to come in a positive way so you may be connecting maybe your partner work somewhere else and a partner is coming home and for some people um, you're in a long-lasting relationship so, or you're uh, about to begin new relationship this is going to be good because the connection on Friday you are going to feel that coming up on Saturday we have the energy of the air fund the heavenly masters and this is organization um, governments and that sort of a thing and this is good because whatever is happening this universal angels is going to help you you have the six of coins coming up again so there is going to be an organization that is going to be helping you and supporting you in whatever endeavors that you're doing and this is going to be wonderful so a Saturday expect to see that an organization is really um, stretching out the hand to help you and giving you a help in hand and this is wonderful this is positive this is good um, situation and good information so expect money extra money something that you weren't it can, it can be money but yet still it can be help in different forms so organization will be extending their hand out to you and this will be good and on Saturday you will be realizing this on Sunday you have the six of Pentacles again so in the weekend it's, it's all about giving and receiving and it doesn't have to be in monetary form it can be in the form of gifts but you will be um, receiving um, 
um, help and there is going to be a transformation that is coming in your life this is good transformation it's not that it's not an ending it's a transformation that is coming in your life this is going to be good because you're giving and receiving this transformation come up with the energy of that because it wants you to say that there's transformation that is coming in your life it has nothing to do with that it can have a situation of uh, um, whatever that was going on is now finally an end because this week is a nurturing week. You're nurturing everyone. You're trying to bring in positive um, situation in every situation, okay? And you're nurturing everyone in whatever way, whatever you're looking for, however you're looking at it, you're nurturing people. There is a nurturing that is going on in this week, and this is very good. The only thing is that if you... Um, if your mother is an Aquarius, a Gemini, or a Libra, there is going to be a little, um, the energies are going to be out with you and your mom, okay? And if you have connected with someone who is an Aquarius, a Gemini, or a Libra, that is going to be a little bit, it's as if a little jealous streak come in here, and this person, you know, because um, it could be someone at your work that, your boss is saying, oh my God, this woman has been doing a good job. And, you know, she doesn't really like to hear that because maybe she was there before. Um, maybe she um, is seeing that she is not um, coming up with the good, um, you know, the present, the presentation of what she used to do. And maybe you're doing a better job and, you know, there's going to be a little jealousy streak. So, you know, watch out, just leave it as it comes, leave it as it is. Don't get involved with whatever is going on as we look forward it's going to be a wonderful promising week whatever the situation is with your parents there is a situation that you have to connect with your parents if your parents isn't here um, and your parents or um, a hair sign which is an Aquarius a German uh, Gemini or a Libra you have to be careful because your parents are not happy about something that you did so again if your parents um, your mom is an Aquarius, a Gemini, or a Libra. There is something that you did that your mom is not happy about, okay? For the rest, um, your boss is happy with you. There are good things that is coming through. Whatever information that you were waiting for, the information is going to come through. And the situation with you and your partner, whether your marriage, um, whether you have been um, in the marriage or, you know, I've been long in a marriage or whatever you're working together to bring something in reality and then you have the energy of the number six so um, no matter what is happening your materialistic situation is going to be um, very positive so you Aries you know please like and share this video because this is a very very good reading for you Aries this is a positive and I always get positive readings for you Aries it's gonna be a good week for you Aries whatever is going on in your life um, but there is going to be a lot of situation with your work and with your father and mother this comes up and your materialistic do not worry about your materialistic situation because people are going to be helping you help is going to be coming help is going to be coming in for you so there is no sense of worry let's see what the um, wisdom of the Oracle have um, to be fair you only need to be fair what is whatever is happening to you Aries you only need to be fair be fair in whatever you do um, as you be fair in whatever you do it will balance justice and need to consider options multitude benefit the law of cause and effect life offers experience that are challenging and experience that are nurturing yet over time they strive a balance you move from being from a static to doing from discovering who you are so this is a wonderful I want to wish you guys a wonderful week namaste until next week yeah.